Hello. We are going to take out pomegranate seeds. Mm -hmm. We're going to eat them for the moon. Yes. It's called Shrek. Yeah, so Adriana decided that we tried a little trick on how to take seeds out of a pomegranate and uh, see so that it makes less of a mess and we'll try to do it as quickly as possible. And Adrian, we caught it a couple little tricks, but this is the fast one that me and Adriana figured out. So the trick we would use be, a Chinese knife. Yeah, and what uh, we do? Wooden spoon. Yeah. And I decided we could use a whistle so we could first stick it out. Yes. And then we could put it in a bowl with the Yeah, this. one spoon. So and so first we'll cut off the tip, as you can see guys, the tip here. What you need to do is just score it off here, the tip, right? So what I'll do is I'll end up cutting it right all the way around. But make sure if you if you begin to cut off the sticker, like if you cut off the, off, off the sticker, and you accidentally do it on like the top. As you can see, yeah, right, as you can see, Jenna. Yep. As you can see the pomegranates here, all the seeds are already here, right? And as you can see, see I'll show you guys. So you can see that there's all these little pods, right? You have one, two, three, four, five, right, Adriana? There's five here, right? So what you want to do is you want to try to separate all of them. Daddy, and, try one. Oh, thank you. Wait, I, taste, I saw two pomegranate seeds. Yes. And I said, Daddy, can you try one? And I tried one. So now what you try to do, folks, is you try to oh. score each pod here. You can see, so you just cut along. Thank you, Drenna. Yeah. So you just score around each pod here, just so that you separate all of them, right? Because that's how all the seeds are held. So and I if you don't them. have a, like hold them, it'll just come out in the big seeds, and, you'll, and you might see some skin of the pomegranate. That's right. Or some wet parts of it. So as you can see folks, that's right, so as you can see folks, I cut each one of these pods, right? So now what you want to try to do is the center here, you try to just take a little bit off here like this, so, right, so it's nice and smooth like this, so now the whole trick here is to hold the center like so, and just separate, as you can hear it, Adriana's having fun, you know, as you can see folks, that how it's separating, and I see the center here, so now I can go and take this off, I don't mind just picking up and probably grabbing seed off before. See when I took off the center, folks? See how it's all open? You see all the seeds? So now look what happens whenever I <clears throat> open this up completely, right? So now the trick that Adriana is going to do is going to grab her wooden spoon for me, please. Hey, Adriana. <clears throat> well, first just that you come on this side, please, Adriana. This is how I do. Okay, so go ahead. So, so hit it with the, the wooden spoon. No, the wooden spoon. Tap it real hard. Go ahead. Keep tapping, feel hard. Keep tapping. Keep tapping. Don't worry about daddy's fingers. Gotta help a little bit. Okay. Good. Keep going. I need this one. Keep tapping. Feel good. Thanks. But when you use the wrist, is when you move them around and see if you can. And you wait. That's right. Okay. Move them. Okay. Well, thank you, Adriana. Right, so now you get kind of like the rest with all your your fingers, right? Oh. Yeah, so right now. You can snack on them too. Yes. If you snack on them and you see from someone, you take it and eat it. So as you can see, folks. Thank you, Jenna. You're welcome. Yeah, they taste like a blueberry. Kind of little, it's not really like pomegranate. No. So as you can see. If you want, you can, if it's easier, uh, you could use a regular knife. But my dad used a Chinese knife because we thought it's much more easier. Every Chinese knife is really sharp. So never use a kid or uh, Unsupervised without a parent, right? Yeah. That's right. That's Only good. tell parent if you can touch it. If they say no, then you're maybe too young. But my dad said I can touch it, but I can feel how it is. So go like that on the floor. Not like, I mean, on the uh, yes. knife. So you don't get cut. The time is this one is the knife, and over here was your shot saw. So, like, 
Like if I look like this, yeah, I'll hurt of. myself yeah. and I'll be lost. But if you go like that, I won't. So That's right. Just don't press sure. really hard. That's right. When you're at the end, you might get cut. That's right. You do. So like Good over thinking. here, don't go really hard. So there you go, guys. Like as you can see, this is the end result of the pronogranite. Pretty much just a couple little seeds are embedded. So it's pretty much empty. And then, like Adriana does the whisk. Okay, stop. And then he gets all the nice, nice little skins here out. Go ahead, what? Adriana, some more, please. Yeah, yep. we see some at the bottom. Okay. And they stick. They could be, they, uh, <coughs> there you go. That, Adriana. There you have it, folks. There's a full bowl of pomegranate, the seeds, ready to eat, and didn't even make a mess. Oh, yeah, and everyone, yep. just to tell you, I'll go over the stuff we need. We need a little, little spoon, yeah. Chinese knife. Yes. What up? A whisk. Yep. And a the person used the wooden bowl, but we used a normal bowl. That's but right. make sure it's made mm. out of plastic. That's right. So whenever you bang it on something, uh, right. you still use the plastic. So thank you very much, Adriana, for helping Daddy to clean your pomegranate and to show their YouTubers how to, to do it very quickly. And thank you very much for help. Kisses, please. Yeah. That's it. Bye. Bye, Dad. Try to bring something to hold the phone. That's right. <laughs> and they trying to help me. So I'll say peace out, YouTubers. Say repeat, Lozo. Peace out.